And we are back. Welcome to Low Energy Videos. And this is Dead Space. A very loud Dead Space. Now, uh... Now, basically, I did an hour-long first part of this, and I messed it up in editing. Oh, dear God, did I mess it up in editing. So, yeah, I'm going to redo it. Uh, on the plus side, it means I should be a bit quicker on everything, but, you know, my screw-up. I'll shut up for the bulk of this. Hmm. Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. Such a little thing. How many times you watched that thing? Guess you really miss her. Don't worry, we're almost there. You'll be able to look her up once we're on board. Sounds like you do have a lot of catching up to do. All right, everyone, we're here. It's sinking our orbit now. All this trouble over that chunk of rock. Deep space mining is a lucrative business, Miss Daniels. Each is seven is a gold mine, according to prospectors reports. Cobalt, silicon, osmium. Now, where is she? There she is. We have visual contact. So that's Ishimura. Impressive. The USG Ishimura. Biggest planet cracker in her class. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it all dark? I don't see any running lights. Corporal, take us in closer and hail them. And stay clear of that debris field. We're here to fix their ship, not the other way around. USG Ishimura, this is the emergency maintenance team of the USG Kellyan responding to your distress call. Come in, Ishimura. You're gonna need to boost the signal if their power's low. Yes, we know. Boost the signal. More. Never heard of a total communications blackout on one of these things. You'd think with a thousand people on board, someone would pick up the phone. What is that? It's a busted array like we thought. Sounds like they're having problems with their encoder. You get us down there and Isaac and I can fix it. 48 hours max. All right, you have the lady. Take us in, let's see what needs fixing. Gravity tether's engaged. Automatic docking procedure's a go. What the hell? Sir, the auto dock. What is it? We're off track, we're gonna hit the hole. Hit the flash shields. That guy just had his damage. Switch to manual, now. Inside the magnetic field? Are you insane? Abort! No, we can make it inside. Corporal, gave you an order. One of the only times you get to see Isaac in the first game. Distance, we'd have smashed right into the side of the Ishimura. Now settle down, let's get to work. Corporal, report. I'm not getting any readings from the port booster, and we've lost comms and autopilot. It'll take some time to fix. All right, let's get some extra hands from Flight Deck to help out. Hold still, Isaac. I'm sinking up everyone's rig with the ship. Okay, we're done. Clean bill of health for everyone. All right, we've still got a job to do. We're moving out. Oh. 
Right. You didn't lose power to the port booster. You lost the port booster. Unbelievable. The Ishimura was the first Planet Cracker class vessel and is now the oldest serving with 62 years of continuous service. It holds the record for highest number of planet cracks with 34 to date and highest dead weight of refined product and 14 trillion. Guess the power's down everywhere. Isaac, get over here and hack the door pad. Or strengthening the extraction workforce on the colony. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Seems like everyone was trying to pack in a hurry. There should be a security detail in here. Yeah? Well, there's not. There's nobody here. I can't pick up any broadcasts. That security console is still live. Isaac, log in and see what you can find. Kendra, get that elevator back online. Power's dead. I can't. Then we root the damn power! Look, if we all cooperate, we can figure this out a lot sooner. Let's get that computer display up, Isaac. Sure thing. I know what I'm doing. Played this game huh, multiple that times. Look good. She's taking a lot of damage. The tram system's offline. Getting around's gonna be difficult. The air seems to be flowing again. That's a start. What the hell was that? Automatic quarantine must have tripped when the filtration system restarted. Everybody relax. What was that? Did you hear that? Gee, I wonder what's going to happen. What the hell? I don't know. Something's in the room with us. Oh, no. Jesus! Over fire! Over fire! Send up power! Send up! Come on! Come on. Got it! Isaac! Get the hell out of there! The door's unlocked! Run! Run. Run, Isaac! Get the hell out of there! That's the idea. <laughs> I like how he just like, oh, he got into the elevator, we can't follow him. Except for this plucky motherfucker. He tried, and that's the important part. Yeah, I've got a long history with this game. I got it on um, the Steam Bundle. To make it clear, I couldn't have saved him anyway. Script the death and all that. Okay, I know that I do this a lot, but I've got to go into the audio and fiddle around with this.
That is just a little bit too loud. Boom, boom. Oh, that's not so bad, no. Yeah. This and the second game for 15 quid. Not bad, not bad. If I sound frustrated, um, it's because I kind of am. I've heard this multiple times at this point. I, uh, yeah, I did part one, and I more or less, I did the first part of this game. Everybody listen up. They're using the vents. That's how they're getting around the ship. Stay away from And them. I screwed up in editing. So this is round two, but even still, I've played this game multiple times. You're off the case, Hammond. I will get you out of here alive. Now, what's wrong with the tram? The data board is fried, but there should be a spare in the maintenance bay. There's also a broken tram blocking the tunnel that needs to be repaired. Damn it! Everything is on the other side of this quarantine. We can't reach it from here. No, we can't. But you can, Isaac. If I can get to the bridge, I should be able to access the personnel files. You fix the tram, and I'll help you find Nicole. Okay. One thing I absolutely love about this game, one of the many things, is this. The, um, the interface. It's so streamlined and... It looks really cool, like he's watching something on a uh, on a hologram in front of him. It's kind of like the Pip Boy. As you can see, I got to chapter two there. I'll just replace this. While I have a little bit of quiet, I just want to say one thing. This game is, in many ways, System Shock 2. Whoa. Like, it's so obviously System Shock 2 at times. It's kind of like, is this a tribute? Also, aliens as well. Now, you see around here? See this motherfucker? This motherfucker was the very first time I had a jump scare in years when I first played this back when it was new. Almost 10 years ago now. He wants to pretend that he's dead. But in reality... That's why they put the save right afterwards, just in case you get your ass kicked. This is Benson, Tram Engineering. We think we figured it out. Smith killed one. Listen, forget about shooting him in the body. You gotta cut off the limbs. Grab a cutter, anything like that. Cut him apart. A cata. You gotta use a cata. Which, you know, why... Why does a mining ship have so many guns? I wonder that. But they don't have nearly enough of these motherfuckers. Plasma cutters are just brilliant. Always do that to corpses. You never Isaac, know. Be careful. Shooting them in the body didn't seem to work. Go for the limbs. Dismember them. That 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. She's following me like this. One thing I never liked um, about it, and I don't care that it's 10 years old, her goddamn um, her hair. Kendra's hair, it's so plasticky. I think that's why every other female has like really short hair. Run, run, run. Oh no, I'm s I am scared it did. The lights went out. For a good time, call Shilong. <laughs> Hear that ambience? I hear that ambience. Hey, you want ambience? We got ambience coming out the yin yang or the shilong. <laughs> Be able to help you with that arm the whole system. When you get the computer online, you'll be able to call the tram from the control room. Faster the better. I can hear something crawling around out there. No. 
I love this game. It's probably my favourite uh, survival horror. But uh, I think two is. <laughs> Took a lot of hits. Uh, yeah, I think two is a better game. Overall, it kind of refines this. Isaac, I've patched into the deck security system. It took some work, but I've got the door to the maintenance bay unlocked. The data board should be somewhere inside. And um, I think that it does better with the mechanics. It kind of refines it. But this game has one moment that is such a turn off. Like, it is such a groan whenever I play it. And, well, you'll probably see it at a later day. No spoils, but it involves a big gun. And you think, oh wow, a big gun, that's fun. Well, it looks fun at first. Isaac, it's Kendra. It looks like the door to the storage room is locked. There should be a key somewhere in the maintenance bay. Thank you, Kendra. Gee, I wonder where the bad guys are going to come out of. Hmm. Where are the monsters going to come out of? I wonder. these corpses. They're so polite at telling me that they're gonna die. Uh-huh. 
isn't this fun when you know where all the jump scares are going? It's like going to a haunted house. They've been to like five times. jinx myself, but I haven't been hit once. And like castles, I am all about the fence. So. Ah, get it? Safety, and it's covered in blood, because no one's safe here. Except for me, because I played this game. That's it, Isaac. Take the board back to tram control and plot it into the computer array. Then you get the tram to come back online. No! From a vent? Really? From a vent? Wow. That's for being obvious. Yeah, I'll play these by axe. I don't know how many times I'm going to cut this video up, well, probably twice. If you don't mind, I'm trying to have a conversation here. Come on. been talking there the whole time. Alright, we're on board and heading to the bridge. Good work. Strange. The quarantine just lifted. Whatever was in the flight lounge must have left. That's lucky for us. Isaac, get back to the Kellyon and prep it for launch. We'll find out what we can from the bridge and meet you there. If we live that long, you're out of your league, Hammond. This is suicide. We're going your to die out here. Your confidence in me is to be noted, Miss Daniels. But I have a mission to complete, and that's exactly what I am going to do, with or without you. Do we understand each other? Just get us out of here alive. Uh, it always sucks when you see a lover's quarrel like that. I never get Hammond's accent. It's kind of like British, American, Canadian. I, I don't know. Well, come on, man. You're trying to change me. Why the hell are you uh, fighting like this? Why are you hiding like this, man? Why are you hiding? Aha! Told you! Aha! Three huh? Ah, 
Uh -huh. Victory. <laughs> Meat football. They're so pliable. Look how pliable they are. Everything can be solved with a foot in the face. I have to go to the ship. Faster, faster! Oh hi, I did not see you there. That's for being hard to hit. Also, I love how we're going to leave on this ship. Like, look at the state of it. It's literally on fire. This is a bad idea to begin with. Sad tuber noise here. You fucks, I wasn't insured. Well, that was probably more my problem than yours. Your problem is being dead. What the hell is happening down there? What happened to the shuttle? Those are at home. It's the only way off the ship. Kendra. No, Hammond! This changes everything! Just let me think. Can you access the command computer? Think harder. It's no good. There's an executive lockdown of all primary systems. Without the captain's authorization, I can't access them. Well, where's the captain? Here he is. Captain Benjamin Mathias. Location? Med lab status deceased. What? How? I can't access that information. Find the captain and you'll find his rig. With his authorization codes, I can crack this computer wide open. Damn it. Isaac, I'm sending the tram back to your location. Get to the medical deck and find that rig as fast as you can. What was that? Come on, bag. You're here for the long haul. Get it? Because you're a bag and I'm hauling you about with my foot. I've played this game so many times, it's not really all that shocking. Good for the store. Good, good for the store. Level 2 suit. It's time to pimp your suit. So, a pimp suit. I'd give so much money to see Isaac come out dressed as a pimp right now. Aww. He only looks like a tank. Oh no. Also get a power node. And I could sell some health packs to get more, but that way lies chaos. Oh, 
Oh, hell, I like chaos. Come on, let's do it. I want my damn uh, extra health, my extra health hole, which is ironic because I'm selling health to get health. I'm gonna so feel this later. How about you buy the node first? And there we go. I increase an arbitrary number by spending an arbitrary number. Video games, everyone. Alright, so that's the end of this video. That's the end of Act 1, in fact. So I'm going to save. Quit, drink beer, and watch stupid stuff on YouTube. Uh, and probably tomorrow I'm going to go and uh, get into Act 2. But I'll also be editing this video as well, so... God, that sounds like a, a razor. Yeah. So, remember to like, dislike, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!